The main components of the male reproductive system are the penis, seminal vesicles, prostate, cowper's glands, vas deferens, testes, and epididymis. The role of the testicles is well known. They are egg-shaped, easily palpable structures that hang freely from the spermatic cord in the scrotum. One testicle weighs around 15 to 20 grams. As well as producing sperm, they also produce the male sex hormone testosterone. The testicles have a connective tissue sheath structure. This consists of collagen fibers and protects the internal structures. Connective tissue cords radiate from the capsule into the interior and divide the testicle into approximately 350 lobules. These each contain one to four seminiferous tubules, in which the germ cells are produced. The highly convoluted tubules have a basement membrane, and inside are the Sertoli cells, between which the germ cells are located. During puberty, the testosterone level rises, which initiates the formation of sperm cells. Due to the hormonal changes, some of the stem cells continue to develop and become the filamentous spermatids. After their detachment from the Sertoli cells, they are called spermatozoa. From here they reach the epididymis, where they mature further and are stored in the terminal segment. The cowper's glands become active before ejaculation. They release their secretions beforehand. This fluid is often referred to as pleasure drops, as it is released solely as a result of sexual arousal. The clear, slimy substance cleanses the urethra and also serves as a natural lubricant. During ejaculation, muscle contractions force the sperm through the vas deferens and transport them into the urethra. On the way out, they are mixed with various sexual secretions. The secretion of the seminal vesicles makes up the largest proportion of seminal fluid. It contains sugar and therefore serves as an important source of energy for the sperm. It is also alkaline, which stimulates their activity. The prostate also contributes to the ejaculate. It is located below the bladder, weighs around 20 to 30 grams, and surrounds part of the urethra. The prostate produces a clear, milky fluid that contains various substances, such as proteins, enzymes, and electrolytes. An important component of this secretion is the prostate-specific antigen, an enzyme that dilutes the ejaculate and is therefore a decisive factor for sperm motility and thus for fertilization. If you want to learn more about the human body, don't forget to subscribe. And if you liked the video, I'd really appreciate a thumbs up.